Ben. And I'm John. And together we're OCB Reactions. And today we're returning to the Arctic Monkeys with their B-side song, Death Ramps. Um, and I just, fair warning, like when you suggest songs, I've actually let's listen to quite a few uh, few songs by the Arctic Monkeys. Right. Um, so there's a good chance that we won't be able to react to a song that you suggest. Um, this one, I guess it's just like not a popular song by them or not like it's a B-side, I guess, the way it's right. explained to us. And uh, well, I'm kind of excited to get into it. I like them. I, I mean, I like this band. Oh, yeah. It, they... Plus, they're called the Arctic Monkeys, so that's just cool. Yeah, they, they've gone through some interesting changes. Yeah. But uh, before we go on, please like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and share, and go down into the description where we will have a link to this video, and check out our GoFundMe because we want your money. Uh, that, well, we want it to actually get a camera instead of keep using my cell phone. And then uh, check out our uh, Cafe Press and get a cool OCB shirt or hat. Get, yeah, you can get it express delivered. Uh, for Valentine's Day, so <laughs> so you can be single the day after. <laughs> um, yeah, but uh, so even though it's uh, Arctic Monkeys, still really no idea what we're getting ready no, to get into. That, that's but, one of the cool things about it. Yeah. Yeah. Like, uh, All right. Well, why don't we go ahead and get started then? Yeah. Surf on acid. It reminds me of the Dead Kennedys. Okay. Yeah. Um, outside, like when he comes in, he won't sound like a warbling goat, like Jello Biafra <laughs> would. Like, uh, and he's probably not as an elitist dickhead as Jello Biafra can be. Uh, that maybe could be. I don't know. But yeah, it's it like be, uh, I don't know. Anything I don't about know. Him. Yeah, but. All right, well, we'll keep going. I just, yep. I had to make a comment. That this is like really warped surf. Yeah. Yeah, that's.
At this point, I'm going to say it's an instrumental. Yeah, uh, that's kind of what I've been thinking for about a minute now. Uh, I, definitely not, uh, and uh, I'm not because I actually do enjoy this, but at the same time, it's it's not a highlight for them musically. No, it's not, but it's a lot of fun. Yes, yes. I mean, I, I mean, I, I'm just thinking of like Annette Finicello and like the. the Beach blanket bingo and like you know sixties beach party movie and stuff except, like, like, except zombies yeah be, 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 because this is still this is way more uh, frantic than yeah yeah some kind of monster yeah maybe Jaws you know. yeah it's a mashup of beach blanket bingo and Jaws there you there we go <laughs> oh baby shark. <laughs> oh, oh no, right. okay so I'll, that's in my head the rest I, of this block I, I did that on purpose for the tag so yeah, okay um but yeah we'll keep going with this I, i'm actually enjoying it it's it's fun yeah it, it, yeah it's just light-hearted fun kind of yeah odd <laughs> I think that's it. Okay, so whoever did that did some very bad editing yeah. because it's showing like another full minute yet. I, uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't. Yeah, okay. So sorry about that. <laughs> um, no, that that was fun, and you know, something like it when we started. At, we started out this block with periphery. Yeah. And which I mean, when you're talking about musicianship, and you know, it, you know, those guys are just amazing. But some it, following with something like this, that's just fun. Yeah, it's like I think when last time we did them, there was in that Christmas block, right? We had like beneath the buried in me and Nightwish and a uh, bunch of like I don't know instrumentally impressive bands. And, and the Arctic Monkeys still held their own because they were fun. Yeah. It's like, uh, and like this, it's like, I can see why this is a B-side. Yeah, uh, it, well, uh, number one, just being an instrumental. Yeah, and, but it was, I don't know, I just, uh, it's a lot of fun and just makes you like the band a little more. Because it showed a, a little bit of courage, a little bit of inventiveness to put that out there. Oh, yeah. Um, like, I, I, I'm thinking this must be... Um, early Arctic Monkeys, because it does seem that they've grown quite a bit from yeah. that kind of sound. It, yeah. But uh, no, it, but don't take that the wrong way. This was, this was just fun to listen to. Yeah, I, I enjoyed that. I um, was glad that you suggested it, and I'm glad I got to listen to it. I would have been one I probably just skipped over. Right. Um, it, it, I'm, I'm still put in mind of, you know, the old surf music, but yeah. a little more fucked up yeah I mean, they uh, had a pretty angry bass underneath them. yeah yeah that, that that was a nice growly bass going yeah. with it uh gave it that whole punk edge or hardcore edge to it it's like that's pretty yeah. cool um no it, it was it was a it was fun it, actually if you think about it that's something you i don't think either one of us could say that often it was a fun instrumental yeah most instrumentals, that, that's usually where the band's trying to showcase all their talent, yeah. all their their yeah. coolness and skills. and It's like compositional rather than just writing a song, which right. kind of was. I mean, it didn't really go back. It, I mean, it ran through its, well, whatever. But, uh, but m most instrumentals, you know, they're, they're trying to get deeper into the music, whereas this one, it was just... It was a fun instrumental. Yeah. It's like, 
it's almost like a little jam session, like you, like they were playing in their garage, and they kept you know what, going that, with it. That's very well what, where where this was probably born. Is it was just yeah, we're having fun with this, but yeah. we, we can't write any, we can't find any lyrics to fit, so we'll just keep it instrumental. Yep, yeah, I. But I guess that's pretty much all I gotta say about this. I mean, thank you um, for you digging into their catalog enough to bring this up to our attention. Yeah. Um, and I hope if you're an Arctic Monkey fan and you missed this, that they, you got a bigger kick out of it as we did. Yeah. Um, I guess that's pretty much all I got to say about it, so fairly well. Thank you. Hey, when you get a chance to, go down into our description and check out our Cafe Press link for our t-shirt.